Hello and welcome to this installation video on installing the RealSense module on your Typhoon H. The first step we want to do is to make sure our Typhoon H is up to date. If you're not sure on how to do it, click on the link below. Let's open up the RealSense module box and find out what's inside. Right off the start we see a couple sets of screws and an Allen key. Underneath that we'll see the RealSense module itself. Inside this plastic bag we have installation instructions as well as the Allen key and two sets of screws. The instructions show us how to install the RealSense module but we'll walk through it one by one. Step one has us remove the camera. We'll press the locking tab and slide the camera forward and set the camera aside. Step two, we're going to remove the Allen key out of the plastic bag and we're going to flip the Typhoon H over. Next, we'll remove the LED cover using the Allen key. Our next step is to grab the RealSense module and remove the connector from the Velcro strap. We'll plug the connector in to the other half, making sure that it only goes in one way and it's fully seated. You Once you're satisfied with the connection, slide the RealSense module from the front back going around the camera mount. Once it's in place, secure the connector tube with the Velcro and place the RealSense module down. Next, we'll remove the screws from the plastic bag. The two longer screws go towards the back, so we'll place those in the back and use the Allen key to secure them down. Next, we'll grab the two shorter small screws and we'll put those in the two screw ports up in the front of the RealSense module. Secure the two front screws using the Allen key provided. Now we'll flip the Typhoon H back over and install the camera. To finish the installation, we'll power on our ST16 and power on the Typhoon H. Once your system has been powered up, Select System Settings, OK the warning, go to Other Settings, and check the box under RealSense Module Installed. You can then back out to the main screen, and this process has been completed. The last thing we need to do to complete this installation is power down the Typhoon H and power down your ST16. Restart your system by turning back on the ST16 and powering up your Typhoon H and go for a flight. Have fun with your RealSense modules and make sure you're obstacle avoiding.